sometimes I too just wanted to be left out at sea. To be so far away from like people and things and just be accompanied by the water and the activity underneath the surface. <sighs> oh man. This is bringing back the laundry. I carried uh, this basket from my car because I forgot I had it. And I didn't want to wait. I, don't know, I felt more appropriate the day or the moment that I'm coming back to have clean laundry. Instead of leaving in the car, like get them and then come back with clean laundry. Ugh. Ugh. I kind of hated how my iPhone kind of automatically turned things up bright when my phone came outside in the sunlight or whatever, it turned it up bright automatically. But also, you know, it, it wasn't any better to actually have the brightness turned down because, yeah, I can't really see what I'm seeing right now. Although I see what I'm seeing right now with, the, with my own eyes. However, I'm not guaranteeing that you're seeing exactly the full frame of everything that I am as I am attempting to show you through my eyes, my experience by this secondary lens that I have here. <sighs> I want to say in some ways I feel really great because it feels like it's finally all coming out. It's like a lot of anger and a lot of pain and a lot of like confusion and not understanding. Yet at the same time it was very cleansing for it all to come out. But at the same time it's like the other thing we were talking about before where I mentioned like yeah when you see someone is less than or however you would like to perceive that like they, they don't have as much as you or any reason that you would think that someone's existence means less than yours. It's hard to explain. I guess it's a matter of framework as well. Like, are you looking at this girl as like, I was gonna say a homeless kid or a girl that needs help or like, are you going to injure the injured thing more when you know that it's weak? Are you going to use that to your advantage to get violent and aggressive? Or are you going to go ahead and be the one that offers the hand to lift up no matter what, even if their hands were covered in blood of their own or somebody else's? At the same time, obviously, you have to be careful who you trust and who you allowed inside your sacred space. And you can say some people don't change, or some people don't want to change, some people don't want to recognize or have consciousness to this, or they don't want to recognize the patterns or why that they're like this, or... It didn't happen for no reason. There is scientific evidence behind all these circumstances on why it happens, and... You could say that there's no problems, there's only situations. Ah, uh, My body hurts so bad, I keep thinking to myself however I can't help but think of my poppy you know what he's going through I kind of feel like he's also enjoying his solitude yet at the same time like uh, yeah man this whole thing sucks he wants to go get an air conditioning unit right now <sighs> it makes me wonder like am I taking good enough care of him like should I be telling should I be like a parent and be like no listen you can't go <laughs> I don't feel like that's my place. At the same time, like, who else is gonna, like, I wanna say keep face almost is what it is, and I think that's why people lie and hide stuff. They're trying to keep face. They're trying to create a face and a facade, an external reality that you think that's true about them. Like, the parts that they, like, they show this part of their personality with this person. Oh, this person knows this about them, so they connect on this level. Like, not everybody has open translation communication lines, like, me and Chris and a lot of times me and my dad actually two people that there's just like no it's uh, no topic off subject if that makes sense or no dumb questions uh, 
some aspects you can say I haven't been taking care of my eyes. I would love to look in Louise Hay's book and see what the eyes mean. Heal your body book. Uh, I thought that was the hammock, though it's not. I see us now. I always wondered how come people never painted their boats extravagant colors? Like, is it illegal? Why are the boats all white? Why can't I paint my boat like rainbow? Or just, why can't I paint my boat like colorful, like with my own acrylic hand paint or whatever? I mean, imagine, because the seawater and stuff, however. At the same time, it's the principle. How come no one, is it the whole break out a thousand thing? Because I, at the same time, I've never seen it once, or is it the legality thing? That's why I think it might be legality. And some, like that guy, his bottom is blue. And he has like maroon trim, you could say. I don't know if you can see that well. You can hear their generator all the way from here. Like you can hear the motor. <sighs> this is definitely one of the most fascinating lifestyles. The boat life. It really is peaceful if you can have like peace on the water that you have to remember what comes with being on the water. The storms, right? The the horrible waves, you could say. Hurricanes is the hugest thing, really, for here. Think about the water. You're home, rocking back and forth. You might have to experience it to truly know what's going on. The water is very powerful symbolism of like cleanliness and depth and emotion. That's why in the tarot they use the page of cups or should I say the house of cups because the vessel holds the water. It's a lot of complex circumstances. I definitely feel like I need a shower so I'm thinking get Poppy and take him to shore. I keep thinking that we should be bathing uh, or soaking the wound in Epsom salt. Yeah, he doesn't want to. Yeah, obviously. I mean, it's a big hole. It's complicated. I don't know. This is just so beautiful. I don't know if you can see that bird in the water either. I don't know. Our devices weren't the only ones that couldn't focus. Our devices is just what symbolizes what happened to us. Like we, it was just out of the circumference. We were too busy paying attention to this other thing in the same framework. And you can intimately initiate yourself with the artwork and play things on repeat over and over again and feel things different times by going through that experience several times kind of like how you do it in your mind or sometimes you have the same dream over and over again it's trying to tell you something it's connected to your subconscious uh. did you notice the sky shit and be a soldier hey that's something else I wanted to talk about some people are here to fuck shit up right it's just what they do they don't do it in purpose sometimes it's just it just happens that way right well in some essence I'm here to clean shit up I took care of a lot of dirty business you could say a lot of people dealing with all kinds of situations that I kind of had to help people process or I went through it mentally with them because I knew them their existence in my mind spent time experiencing their life through like my eyes in some aspect. <sighs> sometimes that can be a lot of power and a lot of responsibility and sometimes we don't seize upon those opportunities because we live in fear and we're afraid of change. There's like this weird eerie look at this like it might rain or something. 
hear the generator of our boat. <sighs> Did I mention I didn't sleep? Was it obvious? <laughs> although it's not like we were up doing like insane drugs, although Chris had had those experiences himself. Uh. Uh. I attempted to not make a contract with that because I was taught or it was stated to me, well, no one decides to say, hey, one day I'm going to be a crackhead and I'm going to be homeless. In some aspects, people do say that because they're like so afraid of it, they almost make it happen, you could say, in some aspects. It's complicated. It's like they knew the truth and they didn't do anything about it. Ah. Come on. No. Current's too strong. Yep. Uh, oh. This is why I probably shouldn't have pulled the choke or hold on, what am I doing? Uh oh. What do I do? Hmm. I did another boo-boo there. Looks like. I could just go reverse. Ugh. I thought I swapped it. Ugh. This is actually still kind of dumb, but... Alright, let's just do it the other way. The cord's right there. time. It's just something you gotta get used to. It just takes practice. Uh, this is a new engine. <laughs> it's been a while. Okay. Uh, not really. Uh, Alright, come on. Aim. Fire. Come on, go, 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 go. No. Uh, go. Yeah. Okay. My current. Uh. Woo. I'm going to drop that here. All right. Hey, whoa, whoa. Okay, we're good. Pause backwards. Alright, I'm bringing this basket on there. Grab it. 